he's in this mode, um, in a mode that I've never seen him. On this intensive a schedule, extremely humbling to see, you know, what he's going through and what conditions he's riding through to make this thing happen. The schedule is uh, changing every day. New things that we're trying either to fit in or to change, or uh, mostly fitting in more and more because he knows that this is once in a lifetime. Straight after he comes off the bike, he would be in events, he would be in interviews. And, and what people don't see is um, him being off the stage. He is in private meetings. He's on calls, he's uh, looking through all the documentation, all the um, preparation for events that's coming in different various countries. He's speaking to potential contacts. I mean, he's on from, from, from the morning until night. Video calls, Zoom calls are happening. Sometimes it's throughout the ride. Unbelievable how much he can handle things in parallel because the calls require a certain fo focus. I just don't know where he gets the energy from, you know. He's he's maybe sleeping about three hours a night at the moment. He's eating less and less every day. There is the one time when I think um, going from Italy to Geneva and it was quite a, a hard day, long hours of ride and uh, he had to go straight into interactions and meetings. He would be drenched wet, he's cold, he hasn't had food but that's also one thing, it's he's not eating at the right time, he's eating too early or too late. And then just to see him come off the bike after a two, three hour journey in the rain and be dancing and then decide to play football with us. It's just, it's truly inspirational. What a, what a human being can achieve. In public events, he's also, you know, like full of energy. He is responding to the people and he wants to give. But, you know, what we forget is that he is, um, you know, he's really stretching himself, you know, to the max. On top of this, there is so much more which is happening in India, in the US, uh, you know, it's uh, the foundation that he has to manage. Again, everything that doesn't work comes to him. <laughs> Wherever the team is going to need guidance, it comes to him. The ease with which he is dealing with all the situations and which could be really nerve-breaking for anybody else. And it's an inspiration to be like that at the moment of our life. For ourselves, it's an inspiration to break our, <laughs> our constant limitations, our constant identifications, <laughs> and uh, be at the peak of who we can be.